morning and welcome back to the studio. Uh, today is Sunday after my big shop update release on uh, Saturday yesterday and I am literally just blown away <laughs> at how many of you ordered something and I've literally almost gone out of stock of the ornaments already and it's only been 24 hours since the release and I just am so excited and overwhelmed with gratitude and disbelief and I just can't say thank you enough. I am just so excited about everything and how well this update has uh, turned out and I'm excited to have to restock things. It's just such a wonderful feeling and all of that has to do with all of you guys and your wonderful, wonderful support towards my little shop and I cannot wait to begin packaging all of your orders this coming week. Um, but because I had such a big, or such a busy week last week leading up to the update and with the update all happening yesterday, I wanted to have one day before another busy week ahead to just kind of relax and do some things that I've been really wanting to do um, and just enjoy a day free from that kind of work. So uh, the things that I have in store for today, I do have to finish up an Inktober, an Inktober painting that I have to do that's for tomorrow. Um, but other than that, I really want to go looking for some fall foliage. It's been really or it's come really really late this year I think because we've had such warmer weather um, but there is a couple of neighborhoods that I know have some incredible fall colors that I want to go check out and see if they are if it's happening yet and um, catch some of that with my camera and just go on a little bit of a nature walk and then I want to collect some fall leaves and dip them in beeswax. I've some, seen some people do that before and I've actually never done that and it seems right up my alley of something that I want to do so I've recently bought some beeswax that I want to melt and um, do some leaf dipping and preserve uh, some beautiful fall leaves that way and I have an idea of um, putting them up in my window so I really am excited about doing that kind of craft later and then I really want to make a blackberry crumble it just sounds absolutely delicious and it's like a perfect little easy autumnal baked treat that I really want to make and enjoy and I the last thing I want to do is I started making this craft with my friend Morgan the other night we were hanging out and started making our own little yarn pumpkin garland so we made all of the pumpkins together while watching a movie and I need to finish it I need to attach it to some twine and I'm gonna add some pine cones in between them and then hang that up in our little uh, tiny home so I want to do that later this evening and then just have a cozy night in as well so lots of fun um, autumn -y type things that I'm really excited to do and can't wait to share the day with you. So again, thank you so much for your excitement and support towards the update and thank you so much for being here and watching and supporting me here on YouTube as well. You guys mean so much to me and I'm just so grateful for you. So let us first finish up this Inktober painting and then let us go adventure out and find some fall colors.
But now we're at the end 